Hey again, so this is another video in the CRC encoding sessions. This one, I'm just doing a decoding of a previous example. So you can check out the other video before this for encoding, but I'm working with the code word that was derived in the previous one. So I need to check if I decode this, I should have a syndrome or remainder of all zeros. And then I'll know that no data loss has occurred. Okay, so let's apply the same principles. I'm still using the divisor here, and I'm going to do again, if you remember from last time, just take off that bottom left one and put it up there as my quotient, and then I'll just strike it through. Don't know why that doesn't like that all of a sudden. Okay, so struck it through because I put it up there, and then let me draw that line. And then let's do the same XORing. Okay, so remember XOR. If it's different, we get a one. So these two, they are different. If they're the same, we get a zero and we get a zero again, regardless whether it's one or zero, it's just different or same. Okay, so what I'm gonna need to do now is pull down this one, All right? So let me get my arrow just to make it nice and clear because I want this to be the same length as this, as you can see. In this instance, they're the same number and the same length. But hey, we need them to be the same length to start our division. And again, you can see this is a one. I'm going to stick that up there and cross it off just for ease. I'm going to copy and paste. So I don't need to XOR that because it's gone. So, and let me again, this time I do a bottom border. All right. So I'm just going to XOR these three. So same. Those two are the same, those two are the same, and those two are the same. So we've got all zeros. And again, I'm going to pull down that zero. You can see this isn't be too interesting, is it? But hey, okay, so I've got a zero there. And because this starts with a one and that starts with a zero, I actually just have to fill this with all zeros. Okay, I can't do anything else. And you can see that that is going to go straight up there. And let me see if I can get this to work when I, yep, strike through. And I'll do my bottom border. Okay, so now I can XOR. It's the same, obviously, it's the same. And then I need to bring down this one. And just draw that arrow just to make sure it's really clear. Okay, so, and that's the last round, right? So I'll take that one and put it up here and I'll strike that through. And again, I'll do my bottom border just to help you with visibility. And you can see same, same and same. So this is called your syndrome. And because it's zero, we know that no data loss has occurred, right? So these three are zeros. So that is fine. That's good. That's what we want. And that means then that up here, the original data word, oh, wrong color, it's the same, can be accepted, okay? Because before, in the previous one, you have to add on the zeros, but we know this was our data word and we can accept it, so no data loss has occurred. Okay, so that's CRC decoding. Hope you found that useful. I'll see you in another video soon. Thanks for watching.